A while ago we made a guide about shooting your own HDRs. Don't watch it, it's bad. Watch this one instead. Your first experience with IBLs probably went like this. Free HDRs, f yeah. Hmm, it kind of looks real. Let's make this shiny. That's better, still no shadows though. Maybe if I had a sun lamp. It depends where you look, but most free HDRs suck. Sometimes even the paid ones are just as bad. Here's how to shoot your own IBL probes, like a boss. Let's compare the two formats. Equa Rectangular Panorama. Takes too long to shoot unless you have expensive lenses and heads, and produces more pictures to process. Chrome Ball. Cheap, fast, and quality is good enough. Step 1. Buy big shiny Christmas ball. Remove thingy. Stick on light stand or lesser advanced stick. Wrap tape around stand to keep ball firmly in place. Important! Keep your ball clean, no dust or fingerprints. I use cotton balls to clean. Step 2. Shoot! Use a tripod and shutter release to reduce blurring. Shoot the full range of light. This means from the brightest highlight to the darkest shadow. Shoot as fast as possible. Weather can change the light in just seconds. Step 3. Process your images, usually 12 to 16 exposures, to create your HDR file. This video is a good guide if you use Photoshop. Step 4. Bringing your HDR IBL into Blender. Set up your world nodes. Select and open your HDR file. Adjust brightness however you want. And that's it. You're done. HDR files can hold a lot of information. If your chrome ball is shot on a bright sunny day, your models should have bright highlights and hard shadows, without the use of any additional lamps. If you shot enough exposures, it should look pretty good out of the box. These are the settings I use to speed up rendering. Now here are some tricks. You'll notice that at the back of the chrome ball, the resolution very quickly disappears, but there is a way around this. Shoot both sides of the chrome ball and combine the two separate files in Blender. Now you have accurate reflections from every angle. Here are the nodes. I'm sure someone can come up with something much better than this. If you do, please share it with us. Want to try it before you buy it? Download the IBLs featured here on BlendSwap, assuming I uploaded them. And if you like this video, check out Gleb Alexandrov's channel. His ongoing lighting project for a book, I don't know, how am I supposed to say this? His ongoing lighting series is jam-packed with awesome tips and ideas. I highly recommend it. I hope this video will help you to create your own HDR IBLs. Thanks for watching.